All right, so now the question is posed, can the logs work in sleeper berth for the short dog also? Here's some clocks taken after three hours off. And if we go back to the grid, we can see that we did better than nine hours here, but less than 10. So it's a uh, qualified for switch sleeper because it's in sleeper mode, even if it was 10. Over here, we have three. Normally we put it off duty, but we're gonna try to see if it works this way. So we can see what our clocks are now, and our clocks are, uh, yay, what I want. So now we're gonna go to, uh, uh, back to uh, done. We're gonna go to menu, and we will do new status, and on duty to get the computer to cycle, uh, to actually execute a program or do a calculation. So let's do okay. Alrighty, now it's in on duty mode. We can go back to view clock and we can do view clocks and boom, there it is. So you can have it in split sleeper or off duty for the short break. All right, bye. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in here and I'm going to edit out this on duty because what happens is that will start clock, um, that will start uh, ticking down the clock right away, uh, starting now. But if I go in and I change this back to uh, sleeper berth, because we can see that the short break can work in sleeper, and this way if you take a longer than three hour break and go for seven or eight, you're already in sleeper mode. So that's kind of nice. And okay. All right, so now let's go back in and edit this log. So the way we're gonna edit this log is we'll type in edit log. All right, and you can see add an event here for adding that 34 hour, add that last eight hours to go into your sleeper mode for your 34, so it's 26. All right, here we go. We're in uh, edit the log status. We're gonna change it to sleeper, and we can go down here and just put an annotation changed to sleeper, L-E-E-P-E-R from on duty for um, seven, three uh, hours given. And we know that's 14 minus the time that you used. And we know that's 11 minus time that you used is the calculation for hours given. So works pretty good, man. All right, done. And this will go back, view clocks. All right, and again, we put it back again, but the clock stopped. So if I hit view clocks again, this isn't a dynamic uh, program, it's a static program, okay? It is counting down for our normal break, uh, but it's not counting down from the um, split sleeper mode. It's counting down from getting here. So we're okay, you gotta hit view clocks and watch it, so, all right.